I love woodworking, and there's one specific project I've wanted to do for some time, to make a wooden knife that's actually sharp and useful. After obtaining this obtuse piece of ebony, I got to work on this obscure task with high hopes that this dense piece of wood might just be able to do the job.
So now with the knife made, all I had to do was sharpen it and see how good a knife made of ebony could be. Test number one was the cardboard box test, which from what I could see was easy for this knife to accomplish. Next test was the tape test, which had an okay result. With the right entrance, the knife could cut the tape just fine. The third test was to see how good it was with soft things, such as turkey strips and cheese slices. As you can see, the knife handled this test the best. The final test was the rope test, and as much as it pains me to say this, the knife completely failed this one, failing to even fray the dollar store quality paracord. Seeing this failure, I tried to add a little bit of super glue to see if I could make the edge hard enough to be properly sharpened, but this proved to be basically useless. And even though both you and me know the paper test won't work, I decided to do it as a bonus test, just to prove that this knife was really ineffective. In conclusion, a knife made of ebony makes a pointy object that's good for cutting soft things, but bad at cutting anything that requires an edge sharper than the wood will allow. At this point, its best practical use is to make for a decorative letter opener that just lives on my dresser.